Come on, give me ten more. I know you can do it, I can see it in you. You call yourself super? Strength, stamina, endurance. That's what we're looking for. The question is interest. Are you showing enough interest? Brisbane Money Management. Determined to get the best out of your money. Hello and welcome to tonight's Rules Guru. This week we're looking at the different signals that umpires will use throughout the game. First up, this is the signal that we would use to start the game or restart the game during the match. The horizontal arm indicates a free hit. The arm will be held up in the direction that the team is running who has won the free hit. To clarify the reason for a free hit, the umpire might use a variety of different signals to indicate what it is, such as obstruction, foot or back of the stick. If you see an umpire with a fist held high, this means that you have just been marched 10 metres and it's a progression after the free hit has been awarded. A 10 metre progression might be for a low level offence such as hitting the ball away. Two arms together pointing towards the goal indicate a penalty corner and two arms together pointing towards the centre of the field indicates a goal. This signal indicates a penalty stroke. One hand pointed to the spot and the other hand raised vertically. For a long corner, the umpire will point towards the corner post. A 16 is simple, both arms held horizontally. This signal is for a bully, and this signal is for a third party obstruction. This one indicates that the first shot on a penalty corner has been too high. Advantage is the arm held high in the direction of the team that has the advantage. A sideline hit looks similar to a free hit. It's an outstretched horizontal arm in the direction that the team is running. This is a signal for five metres, the ball not travelling five metres or players not being five metres away. The signal for time out is arms crossed above your head. The signal for danger is a hand held across the chest and the arm indicating the direction of the team. This indicates a stick that has been used above the shoulder. Now, this also indicates lightning and I'm out here. So these are most of the key signals that you will see throughout the game of hockey and your understanding of these will just help the game flow that little more easily. 